this is your host, Quasar Spill, and welcome back to The Walking Dead. In the last episode, we had to deal with a lot of cannibals. A lot of them. And before we move on to see what new adventure that is going to unfold uh, while we try to find some sort of safety, I wanted to just say I wanted to once again congratulate this game in its aspect of putting the player into... A situation they're probably not used to being in, or an interesting situation that one may not experience on such a, you know, calm level. What I mean by that is introducing Clementine into the mix. I wasn't actually sure of how I felt about her, you know, the go-getter girl, or the brave little girl who can just manage her way through many situations in this game. But ultimately, her presence in this game does influence my actions, because I do like to imagine myself as a good role model, or I try to be. I try to, uh, I try to, like, inspire people a lot of times, and it's kind of like her influence, or her, her, Oh, what's the word I'm looking for? I, do, I should really script some of these openings, or at least run them through my head first. Um, her presence in this game just makes me want to be that much of a better person in this world, because I don't want to, you know, teach her that this world is nothing but badness, even though it is literally the apocalypse. So we're about to start the long road ahead, which apparently involves a train and hitting zombies. So let's hope that it doesn't all turn to heck immediately upon starting. Even though there's a good chance something will happen at the beginning, Previously nothing will happen in the middle, the and everything bad will happen at the end. Get the gates open! We've got wounded! I want to know why you thought bringing more mouths to feed was a good idea. You've been good to me and my family. You saved Duck from those monsters, and you stood up to Larry at the drugstore. I won't forget that. Except for that part where no you forgot that and left anything. me to die at one those point. Those like the people who raided my Calm camp. Down, you're paranoid. Fuck you! Did you tell anyone out there who you were, or that you were tied to this place? No, That's not really. Right. I know who you are, and I know you're a killer. He's not dead! Somebody you know, that's me. a good point. No know one knows who I am anymore. I don't oh, wait, one person does. What the fuck? But she seems to be on my side. Shitload of food and supplies back here. We have to take this, Clementine. We need it to survive. We really Some did need it. Bandits got their eye on that dairy. As long as they keep getting food from them, you'll be safe. And then there's that lady who I'm just assuming is crazy, crazy nanner lady. And we're not going to have to worry about her anymore, because she did. Although, maybe, maybe she ain't that, I don't know, maybe someone else might be interested in her. Maybe that was her mom? That's always a possibility. But I want to assume that she's just some random crazy lady who just took an interest in Clementine. Because there are some crazy people in this world. Are we going to start the game off with someone else we don't know? Oh, I didn't... Oh, I was looking away for a second. I didn't see if they actually had some type of time variation between the two uh, moments. But it seems like, for the most part, ever since the last chapter, Looks we got like our head our together. Huh. Yeah, maybe. They tend to take us by surprise. They yeah, really do. Well, the less I see, the happier I am. It's true, you'd think uh, zombies aren't that smart, or they're actually called walkers in this game, which I'm calling them zombies. I'm not, uh, I don't know why they're called walkers. A lot of them run. Have you seen them? A lot of them are pretty fast. I mean, I'd assume the only people who call these things walkers are people who have seen The Walking you made Dead. Up your mind yet? About what? When it comes to the getting the hell out of making. I bet you're in the let's stay put camp, considering I've been pushing everyone to leave. Uh... We should go. Motels run its course, and it's not safe. It really isn't. Well, if that's what you think, you should probably fucking speak up. Lily's dug in. 
Ah, fine. Wow, that place. A plane? A okay, military. Just like last time. Over the rig, into the pharmacy, and scrape together whatever supplies are left. You better not be zombies up there. there. Hey, we're out of options. Something's better than nothing. Shit. You okay? The ladder's come loose. I'm not sure how many more trips she's got in her. I'm not sure how many One. more trips we've got in us. No kidding. Man, you're such a downer, man. Uh, let's see. There's no safe way through that mess. How can we get around this? Huh. <laughs> Is that all you have to say? Huh. Huh. Hmm. I don't suppose I can push this. Hmm. No. Can't I, you know... Oh, what's this? A witch? A winch. Lily's not doing so good, huh? Uh... She'll be she'll fine. Be fun. If you say so, you're the only one she seems to give a damn about anymore. Well, you and Clem. Well... I guess... You... Did crush her dad's skull in after he took a breath. Honestly, that little detail where they took where he took a breath really creeped me out because it's kinda like he did have a chance. Okay, am I able to put this thing in reverse now? Oh what oh okay. Hopefully power's on. Oh, there's still some power left. What are we trying to do? Girl really? Upset with you for agreeing to take that stuff from the station wagon. Oh, a stepping stool. Oh. I haven't asked. You even talk to that girl anymore? Uh. Duck was <laughs> asking about that guy at Herschel's farm last night. Really? I wasn't sure it phased him. Of course it did. Yeah. It was a scary situation for him, Sean dying and all. I'm just worried he'll always think it was his fault. It's not. Okay, it sort of is. He did crush his leg. You're sure you're up for this? Lee, I'm fine. I've got this. Give me your hand. Uh, oh. <laughs> Shit! Oh. What happened? Are you just getting too old, man? Jesus. Are you okay? No, Dick, I'm shot. No, get ah! off here. When did he get shot? No! No! Go away! Go! Go! Help me! Ah! Somebody help me! Don't yell! Oh, God! Oh, God! What the, what the hell is that? A walker? Walkers don't scream, do they? Ah, Jesus, I don't think so. Something. Okay, now it's too late for you. Fuck. Gotta shoot her. Put her out of this misery. You know we're here. What do you mean? I mean, we leave her alive, and she draws them all to her. Buying us time. Yeah, unfortunately. Think about it. worrying about the ones we can't see. She stays alive and brings them all out of their holes. What is that symbol? There, there's like lever shoot. I want to leave her, but there's I can't end that off. Now. <laughs> I'm sorry. I mean, I know it's awful, but she was bitten. She was. Oh, I feel terrible. I really do, but I had to. Oh. Sorry, lady. 
should be good to clear this place out. He's <laughs> got all day. Hopefully Walker still know how to activate these that. Racks. Don't forget underneath the counter this time. I'll clear down here and then we gotta go. Okay, let's see. Medicine. Yeah. Energy bar, yes. Just grabbing everything, supplies. What's that? Okay, not sure. Um, am I out of time? She's gone. There's not much time now. I don't know. I'm just grabbing everything. Wow, those two boxes were like stuck together. Gotta get out of here. I hope I can't get too much. Okay. Okay. I'm gonna scramble back to the first place and go left this time. Oh, is that everything? Oh wait, the, 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 no, no, I saw it, I saw it! There's no time. Fuck! Incoming! Come on, Lee! Up and over. When did he get shot, by the way? I don't remember that. Still clear. Let's hustle. Oh. oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no, 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 oh, I can't lift it, I can't, I physically can't. You wouldn't. Tough. I just couldn't find anything to, you know, hit. Then there's this important moment again, where Kenny actually thinks to himself for like half of a second if he's gonna ditch us. It's those glances, man. I hate it. Okay, grab the fridge. Grab the fridge. I know. Fridge. I guess I have to aim for the uh, zombie's chin now. Okay, let's see. I'm trying. I'm, I'm actually like there, but it's not letting me like do anything once again. Okay, there. Please tell me that's it. Okay, I can do this. I can button match like there's no tomorrow. Ooh, convenient. Run! I know, it's sad. It really is. You have to run! What the fuck is that? They're everywhere. You took care of yourself, didn't you? We can't argue about this now. Although he will get a talking to later. Oh, the bandits, right. Why are they after us? She's doing okay. You're back. Ben found some stickers in a drawer, and I put them on my walkie. Hey, sweet pea. That's neat. I'll find you in a minute. It really is adorable. Looks like we Let's got see. the kid on watch again. What'd you get? We might as well leave a sign out that says the men are gone. Come and rape our women and children. Huh. Wow, Ken. Kind of so, harsh. What did you get? A lot of stuff. We're fine, by the way. Nice work. This'll keep us going. 
we carry on like this, we'll get through the winter here. The winter? We'll freeze our asses off here. Because piling into an RV with you, after what you did to my dad, is so appealing. Why wouldn't it be? You know I'll do what it takes to keep everyone safe. We're already safe. Take a look at the wall, Lily. That's not graffiti. Those are bullet holes. And we got enough arrow shafts sticking yeah. out of it to dry our laundry. We have to go eventually, Lily. I know, Lee. I know. Eventually is different. At it again, are we? Yeah. Can it, Carly? Don't boss people. Whoa. Around. I'm sorry. Somebody needs to make executive decisions for the group, though. And I don't think you're capable any- We're strongest together. I know you think I'm on her side, but there are no sides, damn it. What about the food situation? What about protection? What about when this place falls? Somebody's got to be thinking about this shit. How has this not been working? We have everything we need. Because of me, Lily. No, because Lee knows how to take care of people, not <sighs> just things. What about medicine? What about medicine? We deal with shit as it comes, just like we always do. And when 15 bandits hop over that wall in the middle of the night? What then? You just going to deal with I mean, that? I'm on the side that we Everything get out of here too. To us is another excuse for you to pull this crap about leaving. All I want is a week of peace, of not hearing it. Do you know how we got these supplies? Your pal and I got lucky and let a girl get eaten out there. What? Some girl came screaming out of an alley. She had dead hanging all over her. She gave us enough time to get everything we could out of the drugstore. You just let her suffer like what? Like bait? God, what is happening? She was dead anyway. It made the most sense in the moment. Lee's right. We've it's been putting true. our lives on the line doing these runs into the city. You wouldn't believe the shit we see. We all appreciate it, Ken. You should be thanking Lee for not shooting that girl. It's not so easy for him. <sighs> Look, Macon and its people aren't savable. It's not a town. It's full of walkers. And the people who were left are dying and wandering out onto the streets. It's hell on earth. And it's coming. This way. It's we not do... going to be easier out on the road! How would you know? What I know? I know you're not above murder. I know somebody has been stealing our supplies. That's right. Stealing! And I know the list of people I can trust here gets smaller every day! Now everybody yeah. get out! Someone's stealing our supplies? Can it better not be you? All I know is, whenever this shit happens, I'm the fucking bad guy. I'd like a thank you for once. For once! You did kill her dad. Just saying. That's kind of a big deal. To ahead. You could say that. Well, I think you did good today. And I find myself thinking that most days. Thanks. Thanks. It's probably worth following up with Lily about what she was saying about missing supplies. Hmm. With her wound up the way she is, I don't want to see her paranoid. No question. And I'd like to talk when you've got a minute. Sure. Alright, so go up there once I'm done, but I'm going to check in with Clementine. It's been quite some time. At least if I'm allowed to chat with Clementine. There she is. Hey, Clementine. Hey, Lee. What's that you're working on, Clem? It's called a leaf rubbing. My teacher, Miss Moore, showed us how to do them when we went to the botanical garden once. Oh. See, it's the same. Um, kind of. Oh, that's really something. How I did that before too? when I was really young. Do you like it here? I don't like it here. Do you want to leave? Where are we going? Somewhere else. I don't know. Maybe if I knew where? Yeah, that'd be <laughs> a good thing to know. I'll talk to you later, Clem. Okay. She's strong. I, I do like her. Cute kid. Hey, Kenny. Hey, you two. How are you doing? We're okay. Just having a little spat. We all carry guns now, and I don't like it. It's the way it's got to be. I know, but I'm not getting used to it. I'm sorry. How are you, Lee? <laughs> you guys, uh, 
trust everyone here? More or less. I obviously have my problems with Lily, but I don't distrust her. Yeah, we can't turn on each other any more than we have. We could, but it's a good thing we're not. About the guns. Don't you start. I just wanted to say, Cat, it's probably good they make you uncomfortable. Thank you, Lee. <sighs> but we need them. There's no doubt about that. It's true. I'm not going to tell him he needs to try harder I'll with Lily. It has later. to come natural. If I force the, if I force that issue, it's just going to end up bad. Hey, Ben. Hey, Ben. What's up, Lee? Have you seen anything weird on the watch? Is I kind of want to get to know Ben a little bit more. Anything? Nope. Really quiet. Really? Yeah, totally. Which is good. Did you ever come down here to making much? I didn't have much reason to. My parents would let me take the car into the city on the weekend. But what's in Macon? It's kind of a waste of time compared to Atlanta. I grew up in Macon. Oh. I didn't mean to say it's crappy or anything. <laughs> It's super nice. I mean, not now, but I bet it was. Is. It's okay. Talk to you later, Ben. Bye. He seems like a nice kid. Yeah, he hasn't really done anything Sounds to make like me Kenny upset. Sounds like actually has that thing running. I'll believe it when I see it. Let's see. Aw, Clementine made some chalk drawings. Cute. Hmm. I guess that's everyone. Lou's had a bunch of hardships. I'm really curious about the stealing food situation because... I mean, we have such a terrible life right now. We can't be stealing food. No, not yet. I will. What I wanted to say was, I've been thinking a lot about you. Oh? What about? You're a convicted killer. Carly, Jesus. And I think people should know. Not because they deserve to, and not because you're a bad man. I think the opposite of those two things. Maybe people I need should. to know because we're hanging by a thread here, and I can't see Lily talk about you without thinking it's the next thing she's going to say. You don't have to tell everyone, but think about who you trust and take the opportunity while you have it. You're probably right. Of course I'm probably right. People might be pissed, and telling them might cause some trouble, but it will be a far cry from what'll happen if they don't hear it from you. Yeah. It's true. So you'll do it then? I'll let people know. You're totally right. Good. I think it's for the best. I mean, we've been together for, what, three months now? You'll thank me later. Well, you better not get attacked by zombies this chapter. Now, is there anything else you want to talk about? Do you feel safe here? Show me a bath with a heated floor and a high-rise apartment and hand me a full-bodied Malbec and then I'll feel safe. I don't know, this place is fine, but we all know that that could change at any second. It's true. You really think people are ready to hear about me? It's not a matter of ready or not. There's never going to be a good time, but there are going to be a lot of bad ones. Right now, I honestly don't, don't see them, like why I need to do that, different. but it does who feel knows like how the right person thing. Would take it, you know? Maybe it's worth thinking about who you want to tell. I'm going to look into this thing. Good idea. 